heavies like Bowser and DK have a huge problem against Diddy Kong. None of them really have the answer to Diddy Kong forward air, let alone stuff like Banana. But you can never ever count a heavy out in a matchup. You you let them sink in there a, a, just a few times and they kill you at 70 when they're at 140. And it can really, really tilt you. But here we go, Charlie versus Shrek starting out on Battlefield. I would say that's a very good stage for both of these. Maybe Charizard benefiting a little bit more. Diddy Kong already having a little bit of problems. Kill, like finishing the kills. He can he has a lot of kill good kill setups, but they still kill relatively late. While Charizard can use like the top platform to kill Diddy Kong with up throw fairly early. Shrek really putting the, the forward air to use at first, but. Chari able to sneak in and down throw him. Shrek is definitely a... I'm just gonna call him Diddy Kong. I can't call him Shrek. I'm sorry. <laughs> but, um... D Diddy Kong is able to get in there with the, the superior neutral tools on Charizard, but... Kind of just trading back and forth, and that's not in Diddy Kong's favor. Charizard won't die until like up smash until 150 on this stage, I think. And Diddy Kong, I believe, is already in kill percent for a top platform up throw. Yeah. Almost died from a side platform up throw, so he's definitely a kill percent for either of them now. Tries tries for the smash, but doesn't really land it. Gets him in a bit of trouble, but. Diddy, Diddy Kong not looking in a good place. He still has a lot of work to do, and it's very hard to do it when you're down so far. Even single hits like that. Jab! Finishing it off. Charizard's jab, honestly, one of the best in the game. Incredibly fast, incredibly long range, very damaging, and kills, apparently. So now with Diddy Kong with no rage and Charizard taking the first stock, it'll be very... Very hard for Diddy Kong to take the first stock, especially with a SD like that. Charlie taking game one pretty convincingly, even even without the SD, I felt he played the neutral very well. Shrek just not able to, just not really even using banana very much. Ah, okay, switching off the Diddy Kong. I'm going to Captain Falcon. Captain Falcon's pretty good at. Ex at putting pressure on the, the heavies, things like uh, the heavies best tools are typically grab and jab and things like falling up air are very good at giving you a, your plus on block from falling up air and you can just put pressure on them very easily. Still looks like he's deciding whether or not to switch though. And hey, we're sponsored by Northwest Majors and out. We're sponsored by Outrage Esports Bar, Betacon Game Expo, Expo, and Tokyo Otaku Mode. Otaku. Wow. Anyway, check out all these great sponsors out. And hey, come to Northwest Majors up in April, I believe it is. De definitely register for that if you're in the Pacific Northwest. Hello. Hi. Three, two, Which what pool is this? Go! This is pool B3. We've got Shrek versus Chari. I'm assuming wins round one? Uh, I believe so, yes. All right. I can't say I've ever seen this matchup, but I have seen a lot of each of these characters independently. Mm -hmm. I feel like it's very much like Captain Falcon is it's pretty good against the heavies. He can really get in there and pressure them and keep them from doing what, what they want to do. Mm -hmm. A lot better than most characters. But Charizard's flame breath off, just as we saw off mm -hmm. ledge, uh, Falcon's recovery is, you know, bad. Mm -hmm. And with Falcon's fast falling, Charizard actually has a combo game. Definitely. And Charizard's forward air kills so early. Mm, definitely. Like, Captain Falcon just, if he can keep the pressure on constantly, he can definitely just bully Charizard. But getting, oh, yeah. off, getting off stage like that, even if you don't get a gimp off, I mean, he got the gimp off. Talk, it, talking but, about gimps. But uh, even if you don't get the gimp off stuff like Flame Breath, you get solid damage. Yeah. And then I'm, I'm waiting to see what he can do with the grab at zero, if he gets a grab before he gets too much percent. But it looks like he's already building percent without the grab, so he yeah. doesn't need it. Captain Falcon being a fast faller, just eating the Charizard combos. Yeah. Which is not... Charizard doesn't have many combos, so... Yeah, actually, I don't know... 
what charge what uh, Falcon's supposed to do against this flame breath. There's not much he, like the only thing he can do against flame breath is not be in a position to get hit by it, which yeah. is basically just win the neutral. Wait, wait, don't is, don't be losing. Yeah, which is very easy for Charizard or uh, Captain Falcon in one of these matchups. But true. Once you start losing, it just gets worse. Ooh, just I, I side I beat. thought I saw the beginning of a forward in there. I think Falcon tried to knee. Just tried to knee the. I I would love to see that. Shrek, I know she's fishing for smashes Yeah, now. Shrek just kind of getting randy with these smashes. Just really wants to finish the kill. Armor's through the... Up. Oh, and throwing up smashes. Just, Mentioned one of yeah. the hits. I think, I think he's out of percent for that to really combo in anything as well. Definitely. Definitely have to settle for a down throw single up air at this point until the, yeah. the up air start chaining. Ooh, I actually think that will work on Falcon. Down smash at the ledge. Mm -hmm. Shrek just really not sure what to, what to do at this point, though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and even when he gets in, uh, Sherry's been doing really well at armoring out with, like, up air or uh, rock smash. So, uh, that's Ooh, it. That's double totally jab it. fly. Not sure if that's true, but it definitely works. Good mix up. All right, cool. So, I'm hopping off. I'll be I'm, here. I'm Nikki. Nice to, nice to come and thank you. I'll be back for maybe top that eight if I'm not in it. <laughs> All right, and I think. All right.